Well, Javian, there are some cool stories on this roster, but I think yours, it might be taking the cake as far as just what it took to land on this roster. Let's go quickly through the timeline. It's 2011 and you are where? I uh, just graduated high school, okay. still at home, going to my community college. No working. football, not even thinking about going and playing football somewhere? I mean, thinking about it, but it's like, you know, didn't really know how to take that step. So you go to community college and you're working where? At Liz, hat store in the I mall. I like that. <laughs> so what, what were you thinking your future was going to be at this point? Man, I kind of went through like this phase of just trying to find myself okay. because I wasn't playing football and that was, you know, growing up, I've been playing football since I was like four or five. You know, that was all I pretty much knew. So at that time, just trying to find myself, trying to find something to do outside of football, maybe take lids to the next level or whatever, like, you know. All right, so then you hear about this opportunity, I believe from your dad, to get back into football. How, the, how did that conversation begin? Uh, and, and we're gonna get back to football here. He just called me one day. He was like, you know, I talked to Florida State. I talked to, you know, this guy and you know he said there that you would probably be able to walk on all you have to do is transfer so you end up walking on and then you get this scholarship and then you start maybe noticing that it could go to the next level and now you're looking at the nfl when did that become a possibility for you my thing was i came from a small city not much talent gets to leave the city okay. so i had to build a lot of confidence to go into a top school at the time to try to earn a position on the field and uh, i knew once i would be able to do that I could go to the NFL if I could, you know, be on the field with that team. I don't think anyone could just come off the street, walk on FSU, get a scholarship, and then all of a sudden you land on an NFL roster. So what was that moment like for you? Did you have that moment of like, oh, I'm in the NFL now. This is my welcome to the NFL moment. I, I have had those moments, but I try not to think too much on them because like when I was in college, my D coordinator, he was always on me, you know, like, don't ever think you arrived. You know, he, he used to always tell me, you ain't arrived yet, you never arrived. Because I could have easily got my scholarship and, you know, just be like, oh, wow, I, I got my scholarship or I'm on an NFL team. But I'm always pushing for more, striving for more. And then you end up here with the Panthers, but no one really realized that you were signed because there was someone signed right before you. Yeah. I came from the same team, both of you from Tampa. Yeah, well, I don't look for that attention though. My attention, I want my attention to be brought from what I do on the field in a positive way. You know, I want to make those plays on the field and then they're like, okay, yeah, I kind of remember him being signed, but you know, that's how I always wanted to be known. I didn't want to be known for, you know, oh, this guy earned a scholarship. Yeah, you, you know, you want to be recognized for that, but I, w I love to be recognized for the stuff that I do on the field. So both of you here getting this week, of course, going up against the team you're very familiar with, gave you your shot in the NFL to emotions of this week going into this game? Just to go in there and dominate, man. You know, that's that's my <laughs> mindset. Go in there and dominate. Like I said, just go out there and be great. Is there this taste of revenge game? Yeah, in a way. But every game, I'm looking to go out there and dominate whoever I'm in front of. But this game, it's going to be, it's going to be good to know when I see the looks on their faces when I make a play or, you know, stuff like that, yeah. you know, because I, I Wait, know Who's them. that guy? Do we let him leave? Yeah, exactly. We let him walk? Exactly. I love that. Well, fans are going to get to know you, but who are you? I mean, who is this player that now Panthers fans are going to be tuning in to say, Wait a minute, who's that nickel there? Who's in that? Like, uh, describe who you are out there on the field. On the field? On the field. I feel like I'm a player who I want to have fun. I want to get out my comfort zone and bring energy. And I want to just make big plays, man. I want to go out there and help this team win a Super Bowl. So you're normally quiet, you said out of your comfort zone? Definitely. You know, the things that you might see on the football field, you're not going to see off the field. <laughs> you know, I, I know how to have conversations, have fun, joke around and stuff, but I'm not like, you know, energized outside of football. Well, we now know to help jack him up out there on the field, <laughs> get him excited, get him out of that comfort zone, and we appreciate yeah. you joining us. Thank you. I Thanks. appreciate you.